Oh, no, God no. Damn. <laughs> this is an acting job. The theme of this restaurant, as you've no doubt discerned, is Hades, or the Netherworld, if you will. We've been delivering pizzas for days now, but this part of the restaurant uh, opens only in a week. Diners will ride in a deep dish pizza through the three scorching levels of pizza hell. After descending through the third level, Diners will be baked inside their own tasty pizza, which they will have to eat the way through. You've taken the wholesome concept of eating out and given it a bizarre twist! I like it! Indeed. <laughs> now you will be appropriately costumed as the Prince of Darkness, and you will torment and act as host to our guests as they twist along the path of the ride. In order to perfect your performance, you'll be practicing today with my niece and nephew. Sounds like a Kodak moment in the making. You'll find your costume beyond this door. Give me a moment to prepare the children. Then we shall begin. Oh, I want to see what that us children, Lucifer thing is. I really must get this ride up and running. I can't afford another mysterious death, so please, no live ammunition or poisonous reptiles beyond this point. Okay, okay, come on, let's go. Yeah, I don't want to. What the fuck go is that on the very here. left? What the fuck is that on the very, very, very left? Kind of looks like a freaking dildo. Dancing around in a burlap suit, waving a rubber pitchfork, really bites the crank handle. I got into show business for the chicks. Can we get this show on the road, former television dick? Hold your water, you little <laughs> sons of <clears throat> bitches. Welcome to Dante's <laughs> Infernally Good Pizzeria. You are about to partake in the demonic horrors we like to call... Um... The Three Levels of Pizza Hell. I don't know if our prepubescent little minds can handle this much fun. Ugh. He looks a little like Miss Ramada, the lunchroom lady from back in grade school. She used to dispense massive amounts of pizza sauce, too. <laughs> Prepare for the troll spew pizza topper! You will be drenched in a vomitous spray of horrific tomato sauce, along with some demented mozzarella cheese! And the meat topping of your choice. And now, let the topping begin! That was limp. I've got to fix this pile of junk to get finished here. If I can't get handsome here unclogged, I'm stuck. Let's see. Do I have anything in here that can unclog it? I've got to use something to un... Big boy here is supposed to vomit out gallons of toppings on each pizza. But he's all clogged up. If I can't get him, if I can't get, him, if I don't get this ride moving soon, those brats. You think we're deaf over here? You bet your feathered tiny will tell Unc. So get a move on. Hey, can I? Yeah. Let me figure out a way to. man, you're done already. Excellent. I was afraid you might need some incentive, uh, like, say, having your tender meat stomped on by Gene Simmons. No need for that, Mr. Dante. I'm still on the job. Be done in two shakes. Maybe three. Let's see. Oop. A divine, all-seeing, all-knowing, mechanical fortune teller. My Aunt Stella had one of these predict her untimely death. Sure enough, 12 years later, BAM! Being where this is a slow point in the game, I should see what my future holds. Tell me, Lucifer! Will I marry for love or for money? Oh my god, see. You will burn in hell. Oh, that's totally Tim Curry. Tim Curry. Can you use the switch? I don't know. And then use the plunger. Okay, so I gotta go. So I can't really do nothing right now. I need to get a plunger.
So I go in here, get the plunger. Welcome, kind sir. I am Hung Ro, your humble servant. The ancient ones are smiling upon me for directing you into my door. What the hell happened to Chubby Dick Strip Club? It was here just last week! The health department shut the club down. They say there was more bacteria floating around in the place than in a porto party at a Grateful Dead concert. That bites! Chubby still owes me for that time I let his ugly sister Hortense give me that scratchy lap dance. I cannot help you with rap dancery, but rap I can dancery, really? for all your prumming needs. Allow me to show you the fresh Omatic 9000. If it doesn't come with a busty nymphette shaking her chimichangas in my face, forget it. I'm on a mission, Chubby. Take a hike! <laughs> your frosted insult has little effect on a Shaolin master. Your pitiful language is wholly unsuited for the true communication of insults. Oh, yeah? Well, so's your old man! Nee, 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 nee. Your yin and yang are not connected, winged one. And once again, your insubstantial English words have the bite of a dog with no teeth. Leave my mother out of this, Mr. One Ton of Lard! So, you're on a quest for inner peace. I know where you can get a piece. Inner, outer, whatever you want. Fifty bucks! Don't go there, crispy fried duck. This is a family store. So, uh, what's the deal with the plunger on your leg, anyway? You did know that you had one there, right? I mean, it's not like you're walking around with a piece of spinach stuck in your teeth from lunch. Yes, I am aware. It was a horrible accident. I was in hospital for weeks. Surrounded by beauteous female healthcare professionals dressed in those tantalizing white nylons? No, I spent all that time in the waiting room. I finally got to see a doctor, but when they found out I didn't have health insurance, they stuck me with this plunger. I took it as an omen and made my career in plumbing surprise. What's all this Eastern philosophy yin-yang crap? A Richard Gere and Tim Robbins playing ping-pong inside your head? A coin has two sides, as does man, as does nature. What? The wind can <laughs> gently blow the feather or topple the mighty tree. What? This is America, pal. Let's stick to the native tongue. English is the chattering language of the monkeys in the trees. Chinese is the true language of love and insult. Oh, yeah? Well... Ling sheng dong gak bing ding tsu ding. That is most amusing. Your face does indeed resemble a festering saw. Go ahead, laugh it up, sinking sun. As soon as I get the hang of your goofy language, you're dead. That remains to be seen, web-footed one. Dwah! Speaking Chinese should be as easy as ordering Chinese. You just point to the menu and say, I'll have the number four with the red sauce. You want everything to be so easy. You don't want to work for anything. That's the difference between us, that, and the fact that you have a tiny little brain the size of a walnut, and I have a superior intellect. Ha! Huh. Pathetic beaked one can't insult me in a simple language like Chinese. Oh yeah? Well, um... Oh, okay. Um... This one has to wait a little bit, and uh, we'll see something. Talk to him. And they enter the character that shows the phrase crane case. Like It's out of reach and of no pointless and promote. Oh, it's just like the bathtub we had when I was a child. Long hours, I'd lay in it and play little splashing games. And then my mother would barge in and say, For God's sake, at least put some water in there! It's either a bathtub or Roger Ebert's popcorn bowl. Okay, I need to get the fortune cookie. Hmm, cold takeout Chinese food. Well, at least this guy eats healthy. The fortune cookies are the only edible things here. <laughs> Not exactly my definition of what a cookie is. Okay. It's a bunch of fortunes. Chinese in nature. Okay, go on. Happy okay. Always avoid your mother. Okay. Okay, it's all I want to talk to you, though.
Enter the form of phrase brain case Ling Shang and yeah. happy okay sleep with your mother okay <laughs> infected men sleep with their mother okay. each child sleeps with happy thoughts yeah so I need to let's see here so I need this thing if infected men sleeps with your mother oh my god i can i can re remember i hope i can re remember that welcome again feathery pedal it out grab this So, yes, what? No. Let's try this. Okay, let's see. Okay, what was it? It's a bunch of fortune. Okay, I need to uh, see. I kept going to take a screenshot of this, right? I can actually re remember the, the words. So let's move this right there. Okay. Okay. There we go. Phone down. Move up this. I got you this time, Tubby. Gok Hick! I see. Uh, Ling Chong. I see. Uh. Crying case. Never have I been so insulted. I am disgraced. Along with my family. Nobody disgraces my mama-san. In all my years, I'm going to kick your feathered yellow butt. Oh. Ugh. Oh, you jerk! You squished my spleen! Okay, I did not have to you. What the so, yes. What? No. I got you this time. Okay, so I did it a little bit too slow. Gok, hey. I see. Uh, I see. Crying. Never have I. I am disgraced. There along you go. with my family. Try this on for size, you soy sauce swiller. Take that, and some of that, and take home some more in a little cardboard container. Well, how do you like that? My rig was there all wrong. Sort of funny, huh? Yeah, real funny. Almost Gallagher funny. <laughs> okay, let's leave. Actually, there's some more stuff over here. Oh. Hello, room service. Send up a couple of bottles of beer and a box of cigars. Oh, and your billboard's broken. Darn kids, nothing broken here. Oh. Um, okay, I need to toss something. There's something for later, I think. Okay, let's look up the sky again, because I uh, see. Da -da. Except the opera is the opera lost. Okay, what? When I use the trash can the lid, except the shall we use the opera lessons with the light bulb? What? I don't have opera lessons. Wait. It's a book of matches. On the cover is a mail-in ad for opera lessons from that fat-faced Sally Struthers. Okay, so I 
think I do have to use that. Well, that's kind of pointless. The only thing this hotline is good for is reporting damage to the bill. There's some the matches with a mail in cover. Mail today. Okay, so I had to go to a mailbox then. Well, let me go back here. I'm I get the matches of the next one's help. And can we talk to the guard and take I can talk to ladies, okay, uh-huh. The door, the house, or this road, I'll get in. I can use the match book with the mailbox. Okay, so I need to go to Okay, so yeah, I was right then. Okay, go here. This is an excellent opportunity to mail away for my free study at home opera lesson course. <laughs> Luckily, it's a quick study program. La 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 Sweet. Okay, now I can go back here. How do you to show this up here? Okay, light bulbs. It's just you and me now. Only one of us is walking away from here. What the hell? I'm talking to light bulbs. Oh, I gotta eat more salad. La 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 la. I can't read what your billboard says. All the lights are broken. You better send someone over to fix it. Well, look at that. I sure hope that roving pack of hoodlum opera singers ain't back in town. <laughs> What's Goober got stored in here? Y'all just move along. I'm trying to work up here. Now we're cooking with unleaded? Okay. Get this up, let's see, um, let's go back to Okay, be able to break it and use the control plan, pull the lever down. What in the world y'all doing down there? Knock it off, you possum lip, Daddy. This break lock Okay. Break. Y'all just knock that business off. Oh, okay, wait, wait, I'm gonna pull the... Turn it back off and... Okay, use the control panel, pull the brake lever down, put the brake... The brake on and move the lever up, okay? Cut it out! What are you doing down there, you scabby crab cake? Oh, okay, I think I think I think I get it. Stop it. Gotta wait. That's it. <laughs> that's what I uh, that's what I supposed to do. Okay, got it. How nobody got down here for me. Well, that's a fine stopper. I'll call the police. A can of red spray paint. And a Spanomatic 9000 wrench. Cool. He may be dumb as a stump, but this repairman's got a nice truck. His parents must be so proud. Finally. Now let's see what this baby can do. Ooh, I can see my life dwindling away from up here. Well, that was a lot like my prom night. Anticlimactic and lots of heavy machinery. Okay. Now I can do all that. 
will be thrown away open the okay, good get to the get the spark plug from the billboard in the next okay so I do need to go up here and get the spark plug that spark plug is just what the doctor ordered no wait the doctor ordered me to keep my hands off my you know what until it's healed if I don't he said I'll have to put it in a wire cage Boom, now I can leave. Okay, now go to Duckman's house. Okay, use the rinse on the sprinkler. This should turn the faucet on. Lee Majors must have used one of these. <laughs> Great! The fence is shorted out. All right, now let's see if it was worth all the trouble. I'll be steamed if all that's in here is an old Limburger sandwich and a left-handed monkey wrench. It's a book, The Easy Guide to Picking Up Women. How lame. How pathetic. How sticky. I'll be doing him a favor by taking this. I don't know how. But what the hell? Okay, let's see what else I need. No exit. Okay, now I gotta go back to here. I've gotta hand it to Dante. He makes a hell of a pizza! I have gotta get this... Let's get this. Say goodbye to clog drains! Now we're cooking with gas? Oh, wait, that's the next puzzle. Totally disgusting. Cool, huh? Okay. So, you're back for more well, ghoulishly well, tasty well, entertainment, well, eh? Well, like, we really have a choice? Poster. We're stuck in this thing. Yeah, whatever. Well, be prepared to be baked to a horrifying crisp here inside... The Broiling Bowels of Beelzebub! So, get on with it already. So, this is the maintenance room. Fiendishly clever. I'm it taking this. Poster? It's a celebrity that the public chewed up and spit out. Just like me. Okay, I see. I was supposed to return to them on the map. And the elves poster will start to glow. It's a deadbolt. It's probably here. i got to get this oven working or I'll be stuck for... Duckman. No, no. Yeah, I know what he's gonna say. Say, what's that tingling? Yeehaw! Velvet Elvis lives! This puppy is all charged up and glowing now! Okay, I'm gonna return to the main room and use Elvis poster on the wall. Okay. I've got a I've got to get this oven working. I should put this back. The room seems, I don't know, empty without it. I was wrong, the room still seems empty. It is a little brighter in here, though. Okay, that's your map. Okay, use the map on the wall. Use the dead bolt to close the door. Deadbolt. Hmm. It's the Spanomatic nine thousand. Oh. Close says. Okay. So I'm use a match on the pilot light. This is it. I feel that special tingle. And there's no livestock around. So this time it's gonna happen. Spank me for saying so. 
But now we're cooking with gas. <laughs> Hold on to your hats, you little rugrats, because it's going to be a hot time in the old pizza oven tonight. <laughs> Welcome back! You couldn't resist, so could you? Okay, you had to come back for YouTube. even more Park ghoulishly good entertainment! Okay, okay. We're baked into a pizza, Spud. We didn't have many options. Let's get this over with. Get ready to go to pieces in this, the final level of Pizza Hell! The Chainsaw Massacre Slice and Dice Ginsu Chamber of Horrors! Yeah, we're scared. If we weren't stuck in this crap, we'd be shaking. And spark plug. Oh. Okay, big fella. Let's see if this gets your engine running. This is it. The moment you've all been waiting for! What? You're going to pummel yourself to death with a sock full of nickels? No, even better. The Texas Chainsaw Slice and Dice Ginsu Chamber of Horrors is finally ready to begin! Hang on, because here we go! Not bad. That didn't bite too hard. Excellent job, Duckman. The children are happily eating the pizza, and the ride is working to perfection. I don't know how to begin thanking you. You got a sister you can set me up with? A lonely aunt? A well-preserved granny? Unfortunately, no. But allow me to present you with my card. It has our toll-free number on it for prompt and speedy pizza delivery service. Just dial 1-800-EMBRACE-THE-DARK-SIDE. Hey, that used to be Ozzy Osbourne's telephone number, before he got old and saggy and a dove pecked out his retinas. That's my boy. I have other clients, sure, but it's you that makes me the proudest. You're the best, and I'm just saying that because that's my job. Feast your <laughs> so talented eyes on this. I hear the chicks just dig horny men. I should have kept the costume. What's this? What the hell makes a person decide to become an agent? A troubled childhood? Chemical imbalance? Severe self-loathing? I don't get it. I can't take much more of this. Wasn't my making it through Jimmy Dante's enough of a credit to get me into Paramount? Duck man a rama ding dong If only it were that simple. Just trust me. You're a big lump of clay in the hands of the master here. Let me shape you and mold you and form you into something that Paramount will be begging for. Well, since you put it that way, yes, I'll marry you. Or trust you. Or whatever you say. <laughs> Just go out there and get that newsman job, that's all. Let's see, I also can... There's something I'd like to use on there. But the restraining order is still in effect. <laughs> it does my heart proud to see that the tradition of the casting couch is alive and well. Oh my god. The kid's a trooper, but what a schnutz. Where's the... there it is. Next one. This ought to be exciting. I'm gonna be a reporter of news! I wonder if all reporters share a shower after a long day of reporting. Is that where gonna... Hello, Maria Shriver. Right, I would love to Superstore. soap your back for you. Talk to the wacky putty son. Hey, I know you. You used to be the host of Captain Piddle Diddle's Cartoon Hideout. Man, I loved that show that when that? I was a kid. You bet your itchy Nielsen's that was me. These days, okay, so I gotta go to I'm the action news department. Are you ready to get to work? You bet. I'm ready to become a dedicated, action-packed, do-anything-for-the-story, on-the-spot news reporter. Just like Maury Povich. Except not so saggy. I live only to transform the world's tragedies into ratings gold! That's the right attitude, son. But this isn't what you'd call a fast-breaking story. But don't I get to interview puffy celebrities? Or drop down from a helicopter into a hostage situation? Or do a fluff piece on the new edible bikini wax? You don't. 
Earlier today, there was a small fire here at the Christmas Tree Museum. I want you to hang around in case it flares up again.